Welcome. We are from Aoba Japan International School. Aoba's mission statement is: the AJIS experience is shaped by a spirit of community. We are dedicated to developing globally minded, compassionate, collaborative students who are inspired to learn, take risk, and lead positive change in the world. Our programs are developed around our core values, which are global leaders, entrepreneurs and innovators, effective communicators, wise risk takers, and effective problem solvers. Our curriculum consists of four programs that progresses from one to the next. They are student-centered and focuses on developing internationally minded learners. The programs are inquiry-based. And focus on developing conceptual understandings. For our senior school, we offer the IB Diploma and the Global Leadership Diploma. Using the Aoba Inquiry Cycle, all students are expected to develop and apply analytical, reasoning, and reflective skills. They are also able to extend their academic and metacognitive capacities. By practicing the inquiry here at school in Aoba, I think that. After well, in university you already have to be independent in your learning. No? It's up to you to inquire and ask questions and then dig deeper, and use the resources to further your understanding. All learning at AJIS is facilitated through a blended learning approach, whereby the perspectives and expertise of the student and the blended learning teacher are equally valued in the process of learning. The blended learning approach is a combination of online and face-to-face -face lessons, where students are introduced to various online educational resources and teaching strategies that enable students' learning to take place at their own pace, path, and place. Classes like maths, where you need like discussions and like visual represent representations, uh, we use this online. A、uh, whiteboard called、uh, Jamboard. Collaboration and teamwork is an essential part of learning in AJIS. Students from K to 12 collaborate to enhance their individual performance, be actively engaged, build trusting relationships with each other, and establish a culture of trust, respect, and empathy within and beyond the school community. Collaborative work and teamwork was definitely heavily integrated in. Our first year of PP, when we first joined, and we were still familiarizing ourselves with the way that class would be、um, flowing, and so our teachers assigned a lot more group work because they knew that we needed to bounce off ideas and get used to that、um, structure. And gradually, I think that built our confidence in the subject, and we became. Um, independent learners. Student agency is highly valued in AJIS in all four programs. Students, with the help of teachers, parents, and others, will be able to develop the skills to control their learning, identify their personal learning goals in context to the curriculum requirements, review and update their plans regularly with their teachers and coordinators, and lastly, to develop a personalized student portfolio. Student agency can be summed up: student autonomy, self responsibility, and freedom to choose our own paths, our own goals, and our own methods to turn those dreams into a reality. In JLD, for example, we have a, a lot of student agency, a lot of freedom to decide on what we think is important for our future and what we should be learning at the moment. In my personal inquiry, I'm studying.、Um, Architecture and physics. They give us the freedom to decide on like what type of project do you want to do and when do you want to get things done by, and just you know they give us a lot of freedom and flexibility. The more freedom we have, the more responsibility we also have. The IB Diploma Program is a two-year program designed to develop social, self-management, research, communication, and thinking skills in students. Through six subjects chosen from different subject disciplinary groups and three core components known as extended essay, theory of knowledge, and creativity activity service. Explain to us the details of the assignment and then tell us when the due date is when we have to submit. And afterwards, we independently go through the inquiry process to complete that task. 
So for example, in psychology class, I learned about individualistic and collectivistic cultures by reading uh, academic articles. Uh, in biology, I learned about viruses and infectious diseases by watching TED Talks. Uh, in math, I learned about data representation tables and how to interpret those tables by asking the teacher. No, the teacher also helps. And what I found is that the school is there to provide us the resources, the skills and the guidance. But it is up to us as students to use those resources to complete the assignment, right? The Global Leadership Diploma is a revolutionary program which first has students undertake a personal inquiry to develop a sense of self-awareness to identify their passions, interests, talents and strengths. The program is designed to create an environment where each student is able to strive and flourish in their specific areas of strengths and interests. GLD students develop their own personalized timetable built from their choices of courses and inquiries they desire to study. Uh, I'm in GLD and what I enjoy in this program is that independent in a way that uh, I can uh, focus on what I want to do in the future and uh, my portfolio and college application. Uh, the f first week was a little bit different because it was like really different from my old learning style but uh, about four weeks in, I'm getting kind of adjusted to it. And the people here are very nice. Taking the train was new for uh, me especially because uh, I live five minutes away from uh, Nishimachi. And it's not hard, I got used to it now, but uh, at the beginning it's different. Uh, like Aiden said, uh, it was very different the first week. Nishimachi, we just started class, normal class from the first day, but uh, we started class this week, the third week, not fourth week, and uh, yeah, like Aiden said, the class, uh, my classmates are pretty nice and the teachers are nice. If, uh, we had a simple TDU, uh, I took a transdisciplinary unit and uh, it's it was just a how to get started and because uh, in ALBA we have the ALBA inquiry cycle and it's just a cycle with four steps on uh, for a, pro a project and uh, we did that for the first two weeks and we picked SDGs to research about. Uh, so the first step of the ALBA inquiry cycle is learning readiness and it's basically to get to be ready for the whole topic and like the basic like plan maybe just planning stage and I think it's similar to Nishimachi it's pretty much similar you just have to like plan before you do the actual work yeah they're, they're inclusive they include us in their conversation or uh, football games and uh, they're just overall very interactive and didn't just ignore us because we're new Else yeah, they're friendly, really friendly, and yeah, they didn't ignore us. No, so uh, uh, when we have, when we have a question or something, always there for us. So it's good to have. Uh, it's way bigger than Nishimachi. Well, not way bigger. It's substantially bigger than Nishimachi, and uh, there's a soccer field and uh, outdoors basketball court. So uh, if you're into sports like that then I'll bus pretty good for that. And if you're doing well in Nishimachi generally, then uh, coming to Alba won't be that difficult for you. Mm -hmm. In the Nishimachi ninth grade, we were like busy with the graduation. Mm -hmm. And so we kind of forgot how like the basic studying like structure, but then like the first three weeks in Alba, we kind of review back to the actual structure of learning. I think that would be a nice um, review. Mm -hmm.
These are the results from the Financial Times survey which identify various skills of importance. As we can see, the skills that employers look for but difficult to recruit are focused on people skills and self-awareness. These skills include solving complex problems, ability to influence others, and drive resilience. The least important skills that are least difficult to recruit tend to be the hard skills that are related to specific technical knowledge and training. With this context in mind, our school aims to prepare our students for the constantly evolving world. Thank you for watching our presentation.